Stephen, two defeats in a row now in the Nations League. How damaging could that be to the good progress that was made coming into this competition? Yeah, it's not what we would have wanted. Like, there's no no denying that. I think that obviously two harsh defeats. You know, I think um, today, um, you know, it was a tactical, get very tactical game. There wasn't a lot of chances at both ends. We had chances. They had some, but not too many. And just to just to kill our goals, and you can see it, a free kick from out on the touchline that went straight in. So we're very disappointed with that. You came into this campaign saying we wanted to win the group, wanted to win this Nations League group. Is that still a priority? Is it still realistic given these well, two defeats? We've made life difficult for ourselves. We've got to concentrate on winning a match against Scotland, you know, on Saturday. So we've got a quick turnaround, you know, and, and focus on that. And then we go to Poland, of course, to play the Ukraine again. So it's a it's an arduous schedule, but one that we must rise to and make sure we're ready for, for Saturday. Looking ahead to Saturday, is it going to be tough to pick the players up after this defeat? Do you think you might need to freshen things I up a bit? Will, I definitely will need to freshen it up, yeah, for sure. Um, some players have played to their maximum now and uh, we'll have to change it up. I just want to ask you about the goal tonight. It seems so unlike your Irish team to concede from a set piece and to concede just after half time. What did you make of it? Again, I have to say it again, but it just seems, you know, the centre backs looked like they did their job, the ball just bounced awkwardly and uh, you know I couldn't believe it went in to be honest with you but uh, we're just you know I'll have to see it again but it looks it looks a disappointing goal to concede thanks Stephen thank you